Hey guys, hope you guys are doing good. So before we get on to the training footage, which I know it's been a long, long time since I did a workout and commentary video, I just kind of want to explain why I started Olympic lifting and the whole kind of story behind it. Um, so as some of you guys may know, I'm in my third year of my bachelor's in kinesiology degree. My major is in sports performance. So as a part of that major, uh, you are required to take an Olympic lifting class. Um, so, you know, just practicing all the Olympic lifts. However, you're not really graded on how well you can perform the lifts. It's more about how well you can analyze it, the biomechanical aspects, the anatomy, the physiology, all that kind of stuff behind it and kind of identify errors and make progressions for how you can improve these errors. So really designing programs for athletes to really optimize their training program. So you know, I'm not really practicing these lifts every day or on a set schedule or anything like that because my main priority isn't to get good at them. However, I do really enjoy it and it's actually really fun. So I do practice here and there. Um, but this is just one of those practice states. So with that being said, hope you guys enjoy. Um, so before I start any of this, I did 10 minutes of a general warm up just to get the blood movement, the body nice and warm and the heart rate up. So I did 10 minutes of biking. After that, I did some joint specific dynamic stretches and you see me here doing some plate squats. If you guys haven't already seen my learn to squat video, which goes over an article about squat progressions, make sure you guys go check that out. But basically for the plate squats and overhead squats, it encourages proper thoracic extension. And I know a lot of people have been commenting about how difficult the overhead squat is for them. But just the same thing as any other new things you try, you gotta figure out what your main problem is and work on fixing that. So whether that be flexibility, whether that be mobility, whether that be just not having the motor pattern from not practicing it enough. So it could be just a whole array of problems that you might have to work on. I think the hardest thing for me is keeping my elbows locked, especially once there is some weight added on. Um, I know there's a cue of trying to pull the bar apart, but keeping my elbows locked will be a big priority for me. All right, so next you're gonna see me practicing some drop catches. And in theory, you're not supposed to lift the bar up. You're supposed to be dropping under the bar, hence the name drop catches. Um, however, I'm still learning the movements, so you might see some bar movement, but it's been getting a lot better. I've been practicing these for maybe two weeks now. Um, so, you know, it's getting there, baby steps. And next, you guys are gonna see me trying some snatches. However, I am still learning the movement, so my technique is far from perfect, um, but I'm still needing to work on a couple things. Um, my elbows first need to be a little bit better locked, I guess. My right elbow's pretty fine, but my left elbow's still having a little bit trouble locking it completely. Also, I'm not getting much extension at the ankles. I'm just kind of doing like a little bit of a hop. And also there's like a horizontal displacement of the bar. There shouldn't be, it should be all vertical, um, but there's a little bit of horizontal movement that you will see on the side angle. And from the side angle, you can especially see the faults. Uh, first thing I see is that my low back can be a lot more extended. Um, so working on extension of the low back. Also, you can really see that my ankles aren't really extending at all. They're kind of just hopping in places. Um, and in this angle, you can see the horizontal displacement of the bar sending me a little bit back. So, you know, this is only week two or three-ish. And it's not like the class I'm taking is based on your technique of the lifts. It, we don't get graded on how well you can perform the lifts. It's more about how well you can analyze the lifts. All right, and this is my first time attempting hang cleans or cleans. Uh, sometimes I'm starting mid-thigh. Um, sometimes I'm starting from the ground. Uh, but as you can see, I am not getting much extension at the ankle, same thing. Um, I can work a little bit more on loosening the grip as I catch the bar. Um, I find it a little bit hard just because when you pull the bar off the ground, you have a tight grip, but then when the bar lands along your clavicle, you're supposed to loosen your grip. But other than that, that is it for the training footage. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I know it's been a last time since I did a workout plus a commentary. So if you guys did like it, give it a quick thumbs up and I'll talk to you guys next time.